I mean, that's so bad. And for you to work as a receptionist with this bad attitude and I'm so sorry. anger of yours. I'm not that bad. I, I thought I lost my way here. Um, I'm sorry, and but... I was getting late. I'm so sorry. No, no, no. I can't. I don't think I can employ you here. Oh god, I'm lost. Where's the location? Forgotten. Gee. Let me try calling her again. Hello? Girl? Um, I forgotten the location you showed me. To where the job okay, vacancy is. I showed you. So where, so where exactly are you now? I'm at the Dingate Junction. Yeah, you see there is a junction there right in front of the hospital. Yes. If you use that part, you see some, some ash building there. Is that place? Uh huh. So when you get to the ash building, you knock and the sleep more attend to you. Alright. Okay, okay. Alright, thank you, girl. You're welcome. Right. Bye. Bye. Yeah, I sent you the money already. Sure. Hey! I'll call you back again. Are you stupid? Are you normal? Huh? I'm Don't you have eyes? Are you blind? Can't you see? I said I'm sorry, okay? I was working, I didn't... I didn't you didn't see you're stupid. Do you, do, do you want to steal from me? Steal from you? Why would thief, I steal from that's you? That's what the, all the thieves do. That's what they do. So just because I... Oh, mistake. shut up. Stupid fool. Why would, you, why would you do that? Is that what people, is that what people hey! are nowadays? Do you want anyone around to think that I'm a bad person, that I don't know how to talk to people and all that? What? Shut up. What? Just because I mistakenly badge you... Mistaken? You're, you're not normal. I think you want to steal from me, thief. Because there is no one here. Sorry for Fighting. badging into you. Have a seat. Thank you. Good afternoon, please. Afternoon. <clears throat> how are you doing? I'm fine, please. That's good. So, how may I help you? Um, please, I heard there is a job vacancy and I applied. You applied? Yes. Vacancy for what? What position? A receptionist. A receptionist? Yes, please. Really? And I'm here to... for the interview. I was never told of any vacancy for research in this Ah, I mean, that's fine. That's okay. So, um, what's your name? I'm Prisla. Prisla. Yes, Prisla what? Prisla Annan. Prisla Annan. Okay, that's a nice name. So, do you live around? No, please. You don't live around? Yeah. Okay. So, how old are you? I'm 21. You're 21. Have you had any experiences as a receptionist before? Not really. Not really. Hmm. Okay. Have you ever worked anywhere? Yes, please. And have you worked in, in an organization that is similar to this? Because this is an hotel, you know. 
you meet people every day. So you've worked in an organization that's similar to this? No, please. You've never worked in an organization? Hmm. Are you, are you a university graduate? No, please. You are not. So which level are you? SHS graduate. You are an SHS graduate? Yes, please. High school graduate? Yes, please. And how old are you again? 21. You are 21. Wow. So is this your first time applying for a job or...? Not my first time, my third time. This is your third time? Yes, please. So the two past jobs you had, um, which and which, what was it? I was working at um, multi TV office. One multi TV office. Multi TV office as a what? As a secretary. As a secretary, and the second one is. I was at the boutique. As a boutique seller. Um, yes, please. Um, so you were selling clothes. I was at sports shop. Okay. Um. <clears throat> So, I want to ask you a question. <clears throat> if I employ you in this um, in this organization, because as an hotel, you meet people every day, and you know, some people might get on your nerves. So, what do you plan <clears throat> if you work with us? How do you plan to improve? I'm sure you've this is your first time working as a receptionist, and you meeting new people at. It will be a little bit hard for you to socialize. So, um, well, so what do you think you can do to improve yourself? Um, just manage. I won't, I won't mind that. Um, when someone insults me, I will just say sorry to them and leave. Or apologize. I won't say anything. I won't, I won't exchange words with them. You won't exchange words? No. So, what if you meet that same person outside somewhere? Maybe another time. Will you insult that person? No, you, please. So you won't take any revenge back? No, please. That's nice. That's nice. Um, on your way here, did you meet any guy? Yes, please. You met someone? Yes. So, um, what was the conversation or what was the relationship that happened? Or did anything happen between you and that particular guy? I I lost my way here, so I called a friend. I didn't even I didn't really look at that person. I'm not sure I recognize him. He bumped into me and and what did you do after that? I I didn't do anything. I was just making my call. You didn't do anything. No, please. Do you remember my face? No, please. Is he? That guy that you're talking about, that guy is me. And you are lying that you didn't do anything. Whilst you insulted that guy just for bumping into you, you insulted me. I, I'm, so, I'm sorry, I'm just so for, sorry. Even, it wasn't like I exchanged insults or I exchanged words with you. I just said I'm sorry. Even after that, you still insulted me. Like, I'm so sorry, please forgive me. Well, I have no grudge against you and uh, I mean I have nothing to say. But what I'll say is that you don't you don't you don't insult people just for the fact that they bumped into you. I mean you with what I saw outside back then when I was going for lunch. I mean that's so bad. And for you to work as a receptionist with this bad attitude and I'm so sorry. Anger of yours. I'm not that bad. I, I thought I lost my way. Um, I'm sorry, and but... I was getting late. I'm so sorry. No, no, no. I can't. I don't think I can employ you here. Please. Though there's a job vacancy for a receptionist. Because the one we have you'll be leaving soon. But I'd rather have someone else. Please. Um, You can leave my office now. Just kindly leave, okay? Can you please find a way in your heart to forgive me? I'm so I've sorry. I've forgiven you already. I've forgiven you already. I, I just can't give you the job. I promise to be able with, to with, with what I've seen outside, I'm sorry. I wouldn't do that again. I'm so sorry. No, I will no, never. No, no, no. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Just give me a second chance. I See, promise in this, to be able to in this, In this case, there's no second chance, okay? Just kindly get up and leave, okay? When you came in, I was very busy. And uh, I need to get back to what I'm doing, okay? So you can kindly leave my office. Thank you. You are welcome. Such a bad attitude.
If you want more videos, remember to subscribe, hit the notification button to get more videos. Lots of Life TH, inspiring the next generation through filmmaking. So, you're welcome. Thank you. So, so this is the secretary that I was talking to you about. So. Oh, this is the secretary. And, yeah. Nice to meet you, Miss Secretary. Hi. Or should I say, Senorita? Um, can you excuse us? Oh, sure, sure. Thank you. Senorita. Yeah. Hello. Hi. 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 How are you? I'm okay. Oh, that's nice. Um, can I know your name? What do you want my name for? I just want to know your name. I mean, it's not going to hurt you. I'm Senorita. Senorita. That's a very nice name. By the way, I'm Gilbert. Okay. So? You can call me Gilby. That's what you want. Um, do you live around here somewhere? What is wrong with you? Like, it's just a question. I don't know why I. And if I live around, what has that got to do with you? It's just a question, okay? And why am I supposed to answer such questions? Don't worry. So that you come and steal me. You even why look like I? an arm robber. You look like a thief. You've dressed like this. You want to know my house. So you can what? Bring up your guys to my house to steal I was, me? I was just asking if you live around. Okay. I don't live around. I'm waiting for a friend. Well, um, that's okay. Um, to be honest, I really thought you were very, very beautiful. Um, I was wondering maybe if I could get your number. And maybe we could chat up sometime. <laughs> oh my god. What's so funny? <laughs> you want my what? I just want your number, that's all. You want my number? Of course, yeah. <laughs> so that what? What business does you and I have? What business do we have? See, see. Do you know me? No. I don't know you. That's why I want yes. your number. So we can get to know each other. For? For reasons you get to know I, I don't want. I don't want to study a thief like you. I don't want to have anything done with a thief like you. Not even friends. A thief? You're you look like a thief. thief. Am I dressed like a thief to you? So you want my number so, so that what will happen? So that you know we can get to know each other that's all and so that what will happen we get to know each other and what listen <clears throat> the sun is really hot yeah i'm really stressed up here my friend has delayed me you can't come and stress me okay okay if you are so bored why can't i entertain you a bit <laughs> you're a comedian too <laughs> oh my god i've never said anything that sounds so funny hey 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 you want to entertain me? Okay, I'm going to play music for you, then you dance. Dance? Yes, are you going to do that? Look, I don't know why you're hey, sounding. Hey, I beg. If you don't have anything to do with your time, huh? next time when you see someone like me, don't even dead. You even stink. Your mouth stinks. Me, I stink. I'll get you a better toothpaste. Rubbish. Gosh. Is that what girls of nowadays are? Can't even approach them. Yeah, hello. 
Rita. Yeah, please, can you come to my office right now? Okay, thank you. Bye. Where did I keep this document? Uh -huh. Hey. I'm here. Yeah, yeah, welcome. Can I have your seat? Okay. How is the work moving? I feel so stressed. I'm tired. Yeah, I can see it from your face. So sorry. <laughs> Anyways, um, I want to introduce to you the new CEO. Oh, okay. That's fine. So, well, since you're yeah. the secretary, I need to know all this. The members in the company as well. So let me get back to him. Um, yeah, hello. Yes, please. Yes, she's in, so please you can come. Thank you. Alright, bye. So, you said work is very fine. Yeah, but everything so is fine. Like, I'm just so stressed mm. there. I need some three days off or maybe one week off. You need one week? <laughs> yeah, I'm You're just kidding. Serious. I don't want to get off. back. I'm just dreaming. Let's say I'm dreaming. <laughs> Tired. No worries. I guess we'll get some break very soon. Mm -hmm. I hope so. For just for like two days, three days. Get them. Your hair looks so good on you. Thank you. Why did you bring it? Um, at Obi's salon. Yeah. Hey. Hello. Okay. Yeah. Oh, sorry. So, you're welcome. Thank you. So, so this is the secretary that I was talking to you about. So. Oh, this is the secretary. I'm, yeah. Meets. Nice to meet you, Miss Secretary. Hi. Or should I say, Senorita? Um, can you excuse us? Oh, sure, sure. Thank you. Oh, wow. Senorita. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm okay. And you? I'm also fine. Um,. I'm very surprised. I didn't know you work here. And I didn't know I was going to meet you either. Oh. <laughs> so, right now you work under me, right? Yeah, we'd say it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, um, so how do you see me now? Huh? How do you see me? Um, I. Uh, Actually, mm -hmm. from the day you left my house, it's like I was so much interested about you to get to know you more. And then I, because I didn't take your contact, I didn't know where to find you. But then, trust me, I've been looking for you. I've been wanting to see you. I really, really want to know you more. Like I want you. I want to be with you. And. <laughs> I didn't know how to express myself. I just wanted to see if you really want me and then no matter what I do to you, you still come for me. But you went away. You see, um, Miss Senorita, my lady. You know, do you remember the time I first walked up to you? You called me a thief. That is what I said. I just did what I did because I just wanted to see if you would still come close to me. You would still want more of me. But you went away. I. It was just something see, that I was see, just doing. See, I didn't see. mean it. I understand, Ricky. Okay. Back then I was in your class. But you didn't know I was um, the manager in charge of this company. No. But anyways... It's fine, it's fine. Well, we can fix things, like... Don't worry, we can, we can fix things. things. Like... There's nothing to be fixed yet. Okay? Are you sure? Don't worry, I'm in a relationship already. Since you rejected me, called me a thief, insulted me and called me names. I'm sorry about that, but I just wanted to know if you truly loved me. Yeah? You see, you see. There's nothing... Look, see. There are so many fishes in the oceans. I just tried my luck. You rejected me and I bounced. Simple as that. But... <laughs> so, let's make things work. Nothing can work between us. Okay. okay. Nothing can work between us. I'm in a relationship and I love my girl. And I happen to be a very, very loyal guy. So, um, 
I just wanted to see and you know discuss this with you. Um, but I think everything is settled now, so I think I should call back. Um, I should call back Jennifer, and um, I'll give her some things, some documents to give to you, so you can work on it. Okay. So now, so now on the, you know, the relationship between you and me is colleague, master. You know. So you know the difference now. I'm above you, you are under me, you work for me right now. Mm -hmm. That's the only relationship between I and you. Do you understand? So nothing as you know, how I was trying to get to you before. So um you'll be working inside she'll be working inside late um quickly. So I think I need to leave. I have some things to do, so bye bye, senorita. Okay.